Uh, don't getting a video done today. This is a big white oak log. This thing blew down about a year ago or a year and a half ago in a storm at a friend's hunting property. And it stayed off the ground except for the bottom part of it. It does have a little rot going through the middle of it, but we think we can cut that off and get, there's a lot of wood, a lot of good white oak lumber left in this thing below that rotten spot. And uh, just gonna probably mill it up into a few slabs and probably some inch and a quarter boards, five quarter boards for using something later on. Uh, so stand by, I love cutting white oak. It smells good. You can use it to cook with. These flitches will be burnt in the wood burning stove like the last white oak video. Um, yeah, so here we go.
So what we're having to do here is this log is too wide for our saw head to come through. If you look down through there, you can see it's very tight. So we're having to cut this edge out so we can get the saw head to come down through there. Not to mention we have this rot at the end of the log. It goes all the way up through it. So we took the chainsaw and cut this wedge out. And then we did find a secret passage to where trolls live. It goes way down in there. And there's probably a family of trolls in there hiding. So hopefully we won't hit them. But anyway, we're going to try to get a big cant out of this thing anyway because it is a good sized log still. A lot of good wood left in that thing.
this white oak with some really good stuff really looks good we're trying to find some water down here to splash on it to show you what what it looks like but man it looks good it's kind of dark right in here might be some oxidization uh, i got a little grub hole in it but man this stuff is some good looking good looking wood We got finished up we battled the rot all through that big log but we still ended up with a lot of great wood got three uh, eight quarter slabs and then everything else is five quarters um, got some that are 12 inch some that are eight inch and which is a lot of good wood but got a lot of firewood too cut this stuff up and put it on the firewood stack and let it dry all the flitches all the cutoffs anyway appreciate you guys watching uh, if you like the videos hit subscribe hit the thumbs up if you have any comments you please leave those I always love the comments uh, and I'd like to thank our veterans and our public safety folks that are out there standing in the gap for us and uh hey let me know what you guys do with white oak uh, i know there's a lot of projects you can do with it but leave a comment on something you do or something you like to see with it but anyway y'all have a great day